There we go. Down you go. I was positive there had to be at least one hiding here somewhere. G'day blondies and welcome to episode 39 of the Loner to Legend Crafting Challenge. Well, this is your host Blondie speaking. Don't go anywhere friend. We're gonna have a banger of an episode. How is everyone? How you all doing? Everyone good? Everyone feeling good? How's radiation in your part of the world? Surely can't be as bad as this place. Well, if you're following me up the uh, series, you probably know that last episode we decided to come back to the cordon because we have some unfinished business. We're trying to clear out all of the remaining southern areas, explore them all, and uh, check them off our list. And that's exactly what we're going to do. Once we've put all of our good stuff that we don't want to bring with us into the stash. What do we got going on for us? Yeah, we, yeah, that's right, we collected ourselves a battery, which is always thrilling, always nice. That will be helpful at some point, we'll bring that back with us. We still have a lot of kit that we can bring back with us, we've broken apart some stuff. It is good stuff, all good stuff here. Do we have another grenade? Let's grab one, just think, oh, we did, we did. It's all good, taking stock. So I think we're all looking good, we got enough health, we've bandaged up, we got all the goods. There's no point in holding off, friends. Let us head to the meadows. For those of you not aware, we're just going to check out the meadows, and I probably should, just to make sure we can actually get there. Here we go. This is the entrance to the meadows area right here in Corden, just a little north of the train line. And we're going to head into this tiny little area. Don't be fooled though, there's a lot of buildings and complexes here. And there's even a, a wiped out military squad that should have some equipment for us to pick up. So we're going to check it all out. We're going to see how we go. And for those of you who think that this is a fairly low level spawn area, the cordon. Check out this guy. He's one frightful looking thing. Look at the more on that. That is just disgusting. That thing spawned in and attacked us in camp here, just while we were standing around. This is the sort of shit that happens as your rank increases, so always be careful. Keep an eye out. I heard noises. And I just gotta hope that I didn't forget anything running out here. I think we got everything we need. Famous last words, huh? Just going to sprint across and secure this building. Sometimes bandits love camping around here. We did wipe out a few things while we were here last time. In this case, some zombies. Alright, let's... Bang. Who is shooting? Let's go check out this stash a little bit. Wow, they're really going for it over there. We'll leave them to it. Anyway, back on topic, how are you all going? I hope you're doing well. My headset isn't doing well, it just switches itself off randomly. Like about now. Come back on, friend. Look at ourselves a couple of flesh over there. They're not going to bother us. They don't eat much. Never quite know what you'll find in the meadow. Though there will definitely be some mutants that we um, probably want to be taking out real quick. I know there's usually a poltergeist. And uh, we may come across a bureau or two. And if we have any um, emissions... Oh, hello, friend. 
If there are any emissions, we need to head straight back to this little village here because these are the only safe points in the area. Everything else, even though it's indoors, is not safe to camp in. Nah. -uh. Don't make that mistake. And you've got to be careful in this village because there are anomalies all through here. We're just going to have a quick look in here. Just a little schnick around. Because it's our first time here. Like I said, you never quite know what you're going to find in places like this. Okay, here we got some food. Never say no to food. Have we got in here anything? Now you do need to check these places sometimes. Fireplaces, stoves, that sort of stuff, because they can have little stash points tucked away. What have we got in here? Oh, hip. Here go, kaboom. Nothing. Predictable. I know. Yeah, nothing there either. Been a while actually since I've been to Meadows, so I'm not as familiar with the stash points here as other places. Cordon is probably my most familiar zone. I did a lot of testing there and Really? You can, yeah, you can sleep here. I forgot about that. There you go. Now what we're really hoping to get lucky for is some crafting manuals. I've kind of given up on the Nosgaroth and um, repairing the exosuit for now, but crafting manuals, and we are still trying to keep a lookout for... Eh, get in there. For that particular upgrade module that we need. But I suspect we're probably not going to see those until further north. So, not trying to pin our hopes too much here. This one we're just exploring for the sake of exploring, because we need to check it off. And Meadows is an interesting place. Meadows is one of the new areas, I believe. I don't think it's in any of the original games. Just a small area. But it has enough of a presence. You can... You get feels walking through this area. Not necessarily good feels. Dig what I'm saying? Wish you could mantle up into these places. I hope that's something that they add in Stalker 2, being able to mantle, to climb up into places. That would be cool. Scratch call, that would be kind of necessary. And yeah, we've got a spoon and a... There's not much in here. I'm not expecting there to be a huge amount. We're not expecting really cool stashes in these sorts of areas. Wow, look at that. Just pull out the detector and see if we got anything around. Pretty sure we don't, but yeah. That building looks like it can be reached. It can't. There's an invisible barrier there. Not going to happen, friend. Hop. Hop. Okay. Eh, eh, the jump can be a little bit funny. Eh. Alright, all we got out of that was a journal. Yay. Okay, we got a friend down there. What do we got up here? It's kind of like Rookie Village 0.5. I'm not sure what the meadows were supposed to be used for. Why it was scrapped from any of the original games. It's an interesting place. Especially the facilities and... Oh. Yeah, okay, we're not gonna... We're not gonna bother ourselves with that. We'll head into this house shortly and have a look. Thoisty fella. Okay. What do we got in here? An energy drink. Yes. Why would anyone say no to energy drinks? They give you wings. 
Nothing. Okay. What else we got in here? Hey! Yeah, uh, that's just a pot. Getting excited over a pot. I don't think we'll worry about that. Now, I know one of these fireplaces has like a stash. Can't remember if it's here or somewhere else. That's why I check all the fireplaces. First time, every time. What do we got in here? Anything? Yet. Anything in the back here? Anything in the boot? Nothing at all. Okay. This is the house I normally come and shelter in. When there's an emission. So can we get up there? No, probably not. This is why I think a mantle key would be fantastic. Wow. Wow. Look at all this stuff. Can of... Hey, hey. Is that just props? It's just props. Why did it say can of tuna still? Because we picked up a can of tuna. Just stuck on the screen for too long. I fool me like that game. This one. This one. We have not been in. Okay, so we got a couple of useful things. Uh, these guys are just cruising around, doing their thing. There's an anomaly doing its thing. We've got a roof cavity doing its thing. Can we do our thing and climb up there? Hello, friend. Are you the leader? You're not the leader. Hello. You're not the leader. Who's the leader? No wonder you're walking around in circles. No one's leading you. I'm crazy. We'll lead them to it. I think I just saw a bandit nearby. Really? Does it actually show both of them on there? I only see one. Maybe the other one's not technically a free stalker. Interesting. Clear sky, maybe. That looks like a beer, a vodka, that's good enough. And good enough. Can we merge? Oh no, they're different. Of course they're different. Ay ay ay. Why do I say that? Because these are that's 0.7, this is 0.7. They're freaking heavy. But we can't really afford to give them up because we burnt all of our cigarettes getting a whole bunch of artifacts. Hello friend. What are you doing down there? Are you going to tell me that you're being chased by someone? You are, aren't you? Hey. No, привет. Uh, okay. If I ask him about work, he's probably going to tell me that he's getting hunted. Maybe? There's usually a guy hiding out here. He's got like a bounty on his head. Mercs are after him. Please help me. You can actually hunt them down as well. I don't like this road because it quite often has anomalies along it. Looks pretty clear up here till we get a bit further up. Right there. I don't think there's anything in the back here. Hip. Hop. Yeah, there's nothing. Okay, we got one there, we got one here. Let's just. Between the two of them. There we go. Okay. So our loner friend reckons there's a bandit cruising around somewhere. There may there's sometimes bandits a little further over in one of these complexes. So we can check that out. Actually, what is that down there? Oops. What have we got down there? Come on. Beep beep. That looks like a searchable log. Let's have a look. That would be from in here, I think. Hey. That's stuff. We'll take stuff. Won't say no to that. Now, I'm not sure about the campfire situation in this area either, so... Gonna have to be careful. 
And these areas are kind of notorious being traps. Hot spots, I should say. How are we looking? Yeah, the vault anomalies all the way out there. Be careful about anomalies clipping through walls and stuff. Just be careful, friend. Got anything over there? Should have checked over there first. Nothing. Of course. Eh. Eh. Let me go. Alright, what do we got here? I keep wanting to scan my environment. It's the wrong game, douchebag. That's not what that key does. Hup. Nothing. Uh, no. Nothing and nothing. Cool. We got food. All right, how are we looking at it? Whoa, that was right in your face. Got anything out there? I don't think we do. All right, let's head back. We can kind of approach this anomaly from the other side. Just need to be careful that we're not going too far. Okay, so potentially there may be bandits in there. And there's a dude. He does not look friendly. There we go. Yep. He's probably going to try and flank over here. No? Earth is he shooting from? Come on, friend. And whatever you do, don't die in an anomaly. There we go. Yeah, we got you covered. Whichever way you pick, we got you covered. Cheeky. It's a cheeky break here, right? Down you go. Sweet. I don't think we need a grenade, but... Got anyone else? Hmm? I think we got everyone. Just make that disappear. Probably just the three. Nice find though. Not bad. Okay, we'll take that. Okay, we got some stuff from him too. Let's drop that, drop that, and 
disassemble that. Sadly, I don't think we need the guitar. Let's detach the silencer. Cool. Alright, let's move up. See if we can loot this other guy. Okay, we got a wob wob there. I was going to say we dropped a guy. This is where we dropped him. Alright. Disassemble you. Get rid of our trash. Not much there. We do have a PDA from all of that. We'll check that out later. Alright. Let's go for a bit of a jog this way. Real careful, like. A careful jog. Almost like a walk, really. Very similar to a walk, actually. Yeah. Yeah, wow, look at that. If there was an artifact, I would expect to see it on our scope about now. There's nothing here. Let's head in. Ooh. Gotta be so, so careful. And this whole area is full of stuff too. Look at this. What do we got up here? Anything? Gotta check. Always gotta check. There's no way in hell we're going in there. Probably not much in there worth getting anyway, but that is way too hot. I'm trying to think if there's a stash here. There may be. Just need the B, because I don't remember the location of all of the hotspots here. So this could be my undoing. Anything? Yet. What do we got on the tractor? Anything? Oh. Nothing under. Got anything in? Eh, eh, eh. Nope. Okay. Why do I keep switching to the grenade? Don't switch to the grenade. Why am I whispering? Oh! That was right in front of us. I don't know about that, but it doesn't look good. Look at this. Boom. <laughs> Holy crap, no. We got anything here? Alright, looks like we got an open path through here. So we're gonna take it and hope that we don't get reamed. I don't think we need to worry about. Can we get through here? Yeah, don't think we need to worry about anything over there. So let's just have a look here. Battery. Pretty sure there's going to be nothing in here. Meadows is a little bit like um, Dark Valley, I think it is. God damn it. You need some charge, sir. Let me. Alright. Meadows is a little bit like Darkscape, in that it's not really fully fleshed out. There was a whole other... For Darkscape in particular, there was a whole other reason why it exists that never kind of made it into the game. Maybe the case? 
Now's as good a time as any to light a fire, I suppose. Hey, whoa, hey. There we go. Do we have any bags or anything here? Better yet, could we make it down this little side road? Is there anything? <laughs> okay, we got one thing here. This place makes me nervous. I'm not particularly well versed in it, and that is a big part of the reason why it makes me nervous. I'm not even going to try and get into that entrance. It's just a bad time. Pretty sure there's nothing up there. This may actually take us straight off the map. Yep, that looks like a transition point. So that's not going to help us, but we got this whole area in here to explore. And explore we shall, friends. Yes, explore we shall. There is a lot to find in here. How far will we get before we encounter some nasties? My bet is on not very. expect to be attacked by now. What is happening? Uh, uh. Hey, another energy drink. Yes, please. And pills. Pills are always good. Alright, we got no one down there at the moment. That could change very quickly. What have we got here that I see an anomaly? Okay, we got one there. Very strange, we're not getting any of the usual disturbances I would see coming into this area. Maybe they haven't spawned, or they were taken out. Got anything in here? I like checking, I always like checking. It's like Christmas. Always got to check under the tree, you never know. Okay, they could be hanging out inside that big warehouse there. Thing is, we can't really afford to stick around too long. So, there's a psi emitter up there. You'll see that as we get closer. Is that a shimmer I saw? Okay, we got a stash which had nothing in it. Yay. Come on, man, give me something. Don't make a fool of me and make all of this trip for nothing. I mean, it won't be for nothing, because we can cross it off the list. But still, I'd like to be rewarded for my efforts. Give to me the reward. What do we got up here? Anything? Hop! Yes, we do. Nothing in particular that's going to really blow our socks off. Ha! Come on, get up. Really? Hop! Hey, 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 hey. There we go. Hop. Whoa! My kind of ride. Alright. Let's bug out into this massive complex and see what we can find. Still nothing to indicate that there might be any um, mutant activity in here, which is very strange. Okay, we have anomalies though. We have plenty of anomalies. Happily trade in the anomalies for some mutants. Alright, let's grab this guy. Wow. Can we get you? Yes, we can. And that was pointless. 
Alright. Anyone else? No? Okay, we finally got our first contact. Why do I keep doing that? There we go. Down you go. I was positive there had to be at least one hiding here somewhere. Take that. Thank you very much. Oh! <laughs> the dunk. Got another one down here, huh? Okay, here we go. Now we get the pseudo. Pseudo, pseudo. Whoa, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay. That'll do it. Great. All of this stuff will come flying at us. There he is. Jeez, man. Come on. Show yourself. Is he stuck in the building? No, he's not. There he is. Took some convincing. Okay. Better you than me, though, bud. Alright, so now that this guy's thoroughly trounced us with all of the stuff, there'll be crates of stuff busted everywhere. God damn it. That. They are my arch nemesis. I hate them. With a passion. I'm gonna stash up here. Is there a stash up here? Random burner anomaly right there. I think you're safe and then. You're done. Come on, guys. There must be something more meaningful here than just a handful of crates that... Really? I can't even pick up this radio? Disappointed. What have we got here? Anything? Okay, we've got some ammo. Yay. Some old ammo for our troubles. Anything else on this conveyor belt thing? No. Alright, let's see how we fare in this area. We should be okay. This is a high psi area. Hey, we've got some basic tools. Look at that. Should be okay. Our psi protection is pretty good. You can see that it's handling things pretty well. You don't need a huge sign protection to survive areas like this. Hey, stuff. Okay. But the heavy... I was going to say, the heavy part is actually... 
above us, but it's not actually. It's right in here. For reasons. But we're done in this area. We don't need to go... Oh, hang on. There's a lockbox. Empty, of course. Should have guessed. Well, this is turning into a very disappointing trip. Alright. But we've still got this area to go. And this area... Scared me then. And this area is... If you get a lost signal quest from Sidorovich or possibly one of the other factions to look for a lost military squad here, this is the place that you'll need to come. Let's have a look. I think we're pretty well good down here. like another entrance up there. Pretty sure there'll be nothing in here. Not a thing. Super disappointing. Fine. Alright, upstairs we go. I'm hoping that once we find these bodies, if they are here... Damn, I think they'd normally be here. Would they? Possibly. Maybe upstairs? And I hope there's something here for us. It's just the naive part of me that wants to find something really cool in this area, but there really ain't that much here. I mean, we found a few goodies. Wasted a bit of ammo. There's no people here. No bodies. Better yet, if an emission hits, we're probably going to have to take some pills because we're not going to make it back. Which is why I'm trying to explore as much of this as I can, as quickly as I can. Oh. There's a whole lot of nothing up here. Anything? No. Nope. Okay. Got a cup and a paper. Schmock on the pancake. And this is the top floor, and I'm fairly positive we ain't gonna find a thing. Got a random computer sitting here. Completely unpowered. Got anything here? We had to cross this off the lift, but lift list. But I do apologize. There should have been more here. I was hoping there'd be something more here. Just something for us to sink our teeth into. Come on, man, you gotta reward us with something. All the effort that we put in. We're stalkers, man. We gotta get paid. What was that? Why? Why you bait me like that? There's nothing. There's nothing here. Man, oh man. That was a major disappointment. And you've pretty much now seen everything in Meadows. That's everything that Meadows has to offer. Yeah, go on. We'll bust him up for it. Yeah, yay, look at that. Yep, some cotton, some cotton wool. Hey. That looks like something. Some ammo. Eh. Eh. Is that all? Sure, we'll take it, I guess. Oh, which one of these weighs the most? 0.34, that'll be about the same, I think. Nope, slightly less. Let's use you. I choo choo choose you. Alright. 
Well, people, stalkers, this was Meadows. Pretty thrilling stuff, huh? Really not happy about that. I was hoping for a little something. We didn't even get an upgrade kit. Let's just check this. Until next time. Yep, sure. That's a whole lot of nothing. Come on. Oh. Seems to be a weird delay when you put that PDA away. Anyway, let's disassemble him. The components are still good. Disassemble you. How are we looking for your 95? Your 94. Yeah, we'll get to you soon. Don't worry. Alright, let's repair you. And we're not going to be using the steel wool this time. Reason? We might actually need these for crafting an upgrade module. So we're going to be holding on to those for now. Hey, give me my gun back. Thank you. Give to me. So I think after this monumental disappointment, what we will do is we'll head back to Cordon. We'll drop all of this stuff off in the stash. We will re-equip anything that we need to re-equip. And then while we're here, we might as well head for Darkscape as well. Let's tick that off the list too. Sooner we get all of that done, sooner we don't have to worry about coming back. We can turn our back on the south and focus all of our efforts on the lucrative north. The lucrative and highly dangerous north. Alright, let's get some cover. And I'm thirsty again. Man, that was quick. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. Yes. I always get nervous when I see the shadows from the clouds rolling over. When they come across very quickly, that's the sign that an emission is right on your heels. It's gonna get you. This guy's looking out here. I'm pretty sure he's like afraid of being chased by hunters or something. He's got a bounty on his head. Alright. Let's go. Let's go. Where is the wob wob? Okay. okay, there it is up there. Stay well away from you. Now what do we like? Okay, we've only got one portion of the antibiotics. I would ideally like more. One more, at least. Sometimes you get emission and Psy Storm back to back. That's not a fun time, friends. Alright. Wouldn't it be funny if the most action we saw was on our trip back? I wouldn't say no. Man, we only saved once while we're in there too, I just realized. Alright, we got some pop pop in that direction. Could be the army checkpoint. How are we looking here? That may even be off the map. What is that noise? I thought I heard a noise. Paranoia. Wonderful thing. Let's just get the base real quick like. Sell off some of our sellables. There's a couple of things we can get rid of. Ba 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 ba. I'm home. Empty camp. Interesting. Yeah, you worried me for a second. I thought bandits had taken over. All good. Alright, that we can use to clean. 
I think we should definitely do that. Uh, let's put this back in the stash and this. We don't need these. These can stay. We'll come back. So what we're looking for is anything that we can sell. Let's just break that down. Okay. Now that we can sell, let's put that at our... Mm. Alright, maybe we will clean our stuff before we go. That can stay. Don't think we need two of these grooming kits, do we? Let's put one back. Don't think we need that fuel armor repair kit with us, because we've got these. Uh, the Bureau skin can definitely stay. That can stay. They can stay. These will all sell. We don't need them. Um, now, don't think we need all of that food either. That can all stick around. Journal. Actually, we'll sell that. Let's just we'll sell that. And the cooking gear, you know what? Let's sell that too, because we're never going to use that. Not in this run. Alright, done. Let's make it happen. Can take all of this stuff, friend. Every last bit. It is all yours. Take it. Take it. Take it to the bank. Okay, I think that's everything. Cool. What else have you got in your inventory here, friend? What's this? I keep agonizing over these things, and I should remember what they are. I mean, our faction standing hasn't changed. So, really, there's not much point in checking a lot of this stuff. The meds and stuff we will, though. Let's get... You want how much for that? You crook. You know what? I'm going to get it. I don't feel safe walking through Darkscape without a second one. Let's look at our ammo situation. So, we've only got nine rounds of regular buckshot. That's not nearly enough. And even though this is pricey, I don't really feel like going into garbage just to get some rounds to come back again. Although, although, what we could do, now that I say this, what we could do is link up here, because you can actually come from the north and head back down through Darkscape. Maybe we could do that. Be a bit of a long trek. But I think we can manage it. There's a base around about here that we can rest in if it's not taken over by hostiles. So that's a possibility. And that would mean that we could restock with ammo at a cheaper price and then make our merry way back. I think I just talked myself into it. I think that's what we're going to do. Good working team. Good, good, good thinking. I like that. Let's do that. Um, I think we have enough rounds. I think this should be enough. Yep, I'm going to say that's enough for our AK. That should be plenty. Um, let's just do a quick repair on our rough looking weapon. Gun oil, please. That's a 94, yep. That is actually quite high. I think I might save that. But, we will get some more gun oil. Okay. Indeed, my friend. Alright, let's save. Pop. Because we're heading to the garbage, let's take some of our haul with us. Kind of makes sense, right? Let's grab these. Just the stuff that we want. Just the stuff that we know is going to be useful for us. That we want to come back with us. All of that stuff. Oops. Didn't mean to grab those, but yep, we'll take them too. 
all of these. I'll take that because it's in good condition. That to that to. Okay, we're starting to reach capacity. Hey. If I bring that with, can I... Bop. Okay, we're slightly over. Let's find something to put back. Um, I think we have enough of these. They can stay. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Uh, uh, 0.6. How much do you weigh? You can come with. Alright. Save once more. And away we go. Let's go, friends. Now, we did get a couple of energy drinks. That puts us up at four. I don't really want to drink one now. But I will. Let's get this bit done quickly. I want to at least get to the beginning of Darkscape before the end of the episode. That way we're ready to go. We're just, we can jump straight in there. And get that shit done quick. We've got quite a haul here. I'm liking it. Always checking. You know me. Yes. All right. Now we just need to survive through garbage and the Dark Valley. Shouldn't be too much of a problem for geared up stalkers like us. But then again, the zone does strange things. You never can tell what's going to happen. Nobody can predict the zone there. You know what? Let's have a look. What do we got here? Anything? Yeah. It was only for curiosity's sake. I don't need to know that badly. Okay, we got some boars down there. Let's try and give those a wide berth if we can. Think we got away? I think we got away. Famous last words. I think we got away. Always got to check. Sneaky pricks. All right. Let's drop this off in the stash, and we are laughing. We'll grab some ammo from our good friend Butcher. And we're good. Better than good. We are amazing. Alright, drop all this stuff off. In you go. Yep, all this good stuff. Actually, we did bring a lot of extra crap with us. That can all stay. We'll keep the stalker patches on us. They could be helpful. That can jump in. Okay, I think that's everything. You know, we'll keep that here. I don't really want to bring that with. It's kind of useless. Alright, cool. I think that's everything. Actually, let's just offload some batteries. Keep four with us. That should be... Seems like a sensible number. Don't ask me why. It's just a sensible number. Okay? Okay. Alright, let's get some shot. Oh man, he's only got two portions. Huh. Let's grab another one of these sharpening kits. These expenses rack up pretty quick, people. Actually, you got anything that you want us to do? No. Bore chops 13. Let's have a look. Do we have that much? I don't think we do. 
not even close because I think we turned in another quest with him not that long ago and he had everything that we could give not everything but a huge chunk all right so we're gonna save cool and then we head off just gonna do cheek breach check just to make sure we're heading in the right direction that's the one we want to dark valley so we need to go near the witch's jelly okay Gonna say I heard things. Oh great, a pseudo dog. We really don't need that. Alright, we'll give that a wide berth. We're not gonna get too close to that side of the hill, we're gonna go on the other side of the witch's jelly. That's one flesh taken care of. Are you serious? How did you not die from that first shot? It was right in the face. What'd you do to my armor? Motherfucker. And for this we will skin you. Prick. That, f that shot to the face should have done it. That's ridiculous. Alright, let's... Should we get anything here? Bet we don't. Okay, we've got zombies on the other side. Just stopping every now and again to check. We're just having a look. Checking stuff out, just looking around. Just making sure, okay? So we can really do. You know? And we just gotta be careful around here. Last thing we wanna do is run into shit. Here, zombies. Where's the exit point? Is that up here? It's up that way. Okay. Should remember this place because I got ambushed here. That must have been, what, 10 episodes ago? A whole other lifetime. And there's no guarantee that we won't run into bandits again here. Let's just try and get in through here before anyone spawns. Yes. Yes. We're so close I can taste it. If you've played Stalker Anomaly and you know what Darkscape is, you know what's coming. And for that, I do apologize. It's part of the challenge. We gotta go here, we gotta do it. But holy crap. Stuff off. I think you're gone. Ooh. Cheeky little beater. Down you go. Really didn't want to have to use too much ammo down here. we got here okay you can move along buddy little friend just gonna head through what is a base down here and I think it's a loner base okay, we 
We've got a couple of fleshes over here now. If they form a group, they will come for us. No, I don't want to. Oh, yes I do. I want to go to the meadow. Really? Oh, no I don't. What am I doing? I don't want to go to the meadow. No! We've been to the meadow. Take me back! How dare you confuse me. Yes. And no. So right, we'll get there. Damn loading screens. It's like, here, you need to go places. Uh, what? Uh, you need to go places. Go now. I'm sorry. I'm too suggestible. Fleshes have disappeared, though. Anybody home? What we got here? Anyone? Anyone? No fire lit, so... Yep, the answer there is probably no. Huh. Okay. Oh man, so many anomalies. I thought maybe there would be a way out here, but... Looks like we're kind of walled in, so we'll have to go out and around. Let's do that. Now, I don't know where the next fireplace is, so we're just going to save here. Let's have a quick look. Yep, that takes us down to Darkscape. Actually, damn it, there is a fire right by Darkscape entrance. Uh, let's head down there. We can save down there too, that's fine. We have matches, and I don't think there's an abundance of campfires once we hit Darkscape, so it is what it is, and we work with what we got. Hello, doggy. I'm getting jumpy. Doggos. Nope. I think we're good. Okay. I'm tempted to kind of bunk down here if we can. Just because I know there's an emission coming. It'd be cool if we could avoid it. Let us. Yeah, there's no bed here. Crap. And it is coming on towards the end of the day. Hmm. Decisions. Did not see you up here before, friend. Hello. And you had nothing for me, of course. So this creates an interesting dichotomy. Do we keep going? Do we push through? Got some caffeine tablets. We got stronger things. We could do it in the night. Tell you what, let's save now. And we'll make that a decision for next episode. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. I know it was a bit slower paced and Meadows didn't really offer us much. Which is a big shame, I was expecting a lot more from the place. There's normally a bit more loot friendly than that. 
but it is what it is and we can now scratch meadows off our list so that's one thing to be thankful for and uh, as usual if you haven't already there's a fair chance you might have already come here from Six's Bunker but if you haven't you don't know who I'm talking about please go check out Six's Bunker he's also doing a challenge like this playing as the bandits and um, he seems to be having an absolute blast with it and he's a lot of fun to watch please do check him out link is in the description I also have another channel which I run called Hey Blondie and on that I do long form video game analysis so if that thing is if that sort of thing is your jam do go check that out too I love seeing um, people in the comments telling me about the old games that they love to play and and the experiences they had and they don't even have to be old I play lots of I play all games I'm not discriminating that way I don't I don't discriminate is what I meant to say uh, old games new games they're all good fun and uh, finally, if you're enjoying this series and you like the stuff that I'm putting out on the channel, do me a favor and like and subscribe. The algorithm loves you. And I love you if you do it. Thank you. It is very nice. Thank you, comrade. We need to support other stalkers in the zone, yes? And, as always, until next time, good hunting, stalker.